Alright, welcome back to Let's Play Crusader Kings 2. We still on Chief Abdul Rahman, and the Umayyads are in a whole heap of trouble. However, the problem is that we can't we don't really have any good CBs on them. Um, we have the Conquest CB, which we would just get um, it would just become the dude's liege uh, of, say, like this province or, or this province or whatever. He doesn't directly own any of these provinces. Um, although, this guy does. Uh, what would happen if I attacked for Tangiers? Or something like that. I gain the Sheikdom, so the only province I have to worry about is that one. So this guy, um, do you only have Fez? Yeah, he only has Fez. So, for example, if I were to declare war for this one, would I keep it? I was thinking El Rif because it's the best one. So would I keep uh, Sujil Masa? Yeah, I would get it. Um, the reason I don't want to have the proper holdings, uh, I don't want to have the, these guys as my dudes, is because number one, they're the wrong religion. Number two, they would become feudal vassals, which I don't want. Why can I do this now? I was just going to say I need to be... I don't have the tribal, but I, I guess I have absolute tribal, and that counts. Why couldn't I do it before? I guess we'll go ahead and take it. That doesn't affect my domain size. Oh, it does. Okay. Well, in that case, I, I also want to have a city in Fez. Uh, so, space tax is 20, or a 15... Space tax is 12, so we'll take this one. Will you give me your city? Yes, he will. Okay, so we want that so that we have a city here, because I think if we convert to Martric Republic and there's a city here, that will become our primary title. I'm not sure. Now we're waiting for our prestige to go up to get uh, the uh, tribal army, but I think it's worth it to take that thing away. So if I'm going to fight the Umayyads, I definitely want to get a province. This one's good because it blocks them off from invading the Songhai and Ghana regions down here. Uh, it's part of Fez. There's only three provinces I don't own that are in Fez, so if I got two of them, then that would be good. Um, it'll help the Umayyads do worse because, uh, speaking of that, I was looking around at people who have a good chance of winning. And this guy has got 2,000. And this guy's only got, like, 500. And of course, I don't want to have my relations with Lombardy up, because they're probably going to holy war at me anyway. To cause even more distraction here, I think being at war for, with them would be a good idea. But to really take advantage of it, I have to do something over here. And these are... Tangier is one of the best provinces in the region. Um... So that would be a good thing to have. On the other hand, Fez... If I got two duchies, I'd become a, a great duke and it would raise my domain limit one, I think. I think it still does that. And then I could eat the tribal penalty. Uh, I could eat not having the tribal bonus without having any problems. As as long as I got rid, away, get, got rid of some of my minor holdings. Now, um... could also go after Figuig, which would have the same effect as everything else, and is a much better province than this one. This is also Bedouin culture, which is bad. Um, El Rif is also Catholic. I'm not sure if that's good or bad. And yeah, these two are also Catholic still. Um, 
so I guess we're going after... See, this guy has a bunch of sheikdoms, so I think if I went after Figuig, I would still own it. See, the things that are owned by dukes, I can't not take away. Um, this guy is a direct vassal of some other dude. So, well, um, this guy. But if I'm taking, say, the, the county from this guy, he can't become my my vassal because I'm a level below him. Um, uh, no, I'm not a level below him. I'm, I'm of the same level as him. So, uh, which counties can I actually take? So this would make me Sheikh Idris' liege. This I would take. This I would take. I would take that. Take that. So I, the only one I can't take is El Rif, which is kind of a bad province to take anyway. In any case, we have to wait until we get 500 prestige. Um, and maybe some money for some mercenaries. We're working on another building here. And I didn't want to convert to a merchant republic before that building was finished. Because otherwise... It has some issues. Um, let's go ahead and rework my counselors a little bit. I don't remember what they're doing. He's in Tunis. It's our relations with the Sultan. A hundred, so there's no reason to have him there. Let's actually go send him to talk to this guy. And let's put our spy master here also, just so we can see what's going on. This is the most important thing. Uh, we got this guy building legend. Let's take this guy to build seal in my capital as well. Maybe we'll get a a dude. Raid organization, I don't think is a good idea. We'll just keep doing what we've been doing. Now we're like 60, 64. So we need to be careful. So he's going around these guys. Is this even there? This is Africa. Ooh, the lion. So who's Africa at war with? Lombardy. Okay. So if I'd attack them, I wouldn't be at war with uh, Lombardy. So we just need to wait a few months. We get a lot of prestige for different stuff. How much do mercenaries cost? I don't think it's a realistic option. Looks like 240 really is my best option. The Mamluks! Dude. Horse archers! It's crazy. Okay, let's go fight a lion. They're also very, very expensive, so I'd, I'd need about 300 to really pay for those. So let's, let's not worry about mercenaries. Shifta! Oh, she's the genius. Let's see if we get a genius kid. Okay, so this is... <laughs> the thing where I get a bonus. It's nice. You always strive to be humble, never forgetting the roots of yourself and your ancestors. There are many lessons from the past that you will still be heated today. Get this because I have a humble trait. So I lose two decadence. That's nice. Stupid son. My steward, Chief Abdul, tells me that his efforts at increasing religious fervor among the people met with great success. A small army of zealots converged on it, so I'm ready to serve. I simply need to attack some suitable infidel before my recruits wander off in disgust. I think these guys count. So that's cool. I'll lose piety if I'm not controlling them. Um. Oh, he's got 20 marshal now. Okay, Umar. I, I definitely need to solidify Umar as my heir. Umar is really good. Doesn't have any sons, but we can fix that once he becomes the leader. Um, so we need to give you town. I have that uh, mosque. I'll give him the mosque. Mosque. And this should be... Make him my heir? He does. Okay, good. Good, good, good. This is the way one of the um, things in Crusader Kings 1. My favorite way, my favorite inheritance law worked in Crusader Kings 1. So I actually really like playing as the Muslims for that reason. 
Um, elective's a little tougher because it means you have to actually play by the AI's rules rather than just making your own. <laughs> a skilled tactician. So this guy's going to come of age soon. So a couple more months and then we can declare war. We might want to pick a an opportune moment. Uh, okay. So let's take a look. Uh, we have... I guess Figuige is the best idea. It's our bar culture. It has a an Islamic religion. It is the best province out of these options. It's not coastal, but that's not really the point. Um, it has a city. It's in Fez. So that basically means that this is the best option. Uh, actually, you can stay here. Do I have anybody better? I'd really like to have my other son have a 24-20-20 flank situation. 21 even. Hmm. Yeah, since these are Ibadi zealots, they should have no problem fighting Sunnis. Okay, um. Well, we gotta do this now. So we have enough money to maintain the tribal armies for a while. Oops. That's not really what I wanted to do. It's okay. Let's raise our armies. It's only a hundred dudes. Let's go ahead and raise the tribal army. Now what we want to do is we want to sit over here. Uh, I guess you can sit here. I'm going to sit over here so that um, if the Caliph decides he wants to come, or not Caliph. I like that California joke, by the way. Alright, I could just come over here and siege this down. What? Nope. Nope. No, you don't. Good timing. So we're now High Chief Umar. We have eight of five provinces. That might reset once we once our wife kicks in. Um, we're not nearly as good anymore. But that's okay. Ramon. Let's check our stuff here. Oh, we got some terrible dudes. Duel. Spymaster. Steward. Ramon can be my marshal. Yes. So I've got to reset my diplomatic relations with Africa here. You need to build legend here. Let's put my spy network back here. I still don't see anything. Um, you can perform charity. I think we're pretty good. Now. I need ambition. Have a son. That's a good one. Can prison who? My wife? Why? What did you do? And your plot. Also, I should to declare. Uh, ask for her conversion. Pretender and claim it to the Wazirid Emirate.
brother? That's okay. But how about me instead? So we're Umar now. Diligent, brave, gluttonous, humble, zealous, and greedy. Zealous is actually really good. Uh, now that I know that, um, we need to make this guy proselytize. Want a battle here? No, actually, wasn't the right dude. <laughs> okay. I guess I'm just hostile to them. Yes. Why can I imprison him? Because he's decadent? I don't really care about that right now. Okay, who would I want to inherit next? Well, my brother here. It's probably a good choice. Um, he's not terribly good, but... Uh, okay. Rahman can be... Chief of the Canaries. That way I get rid of that title. Let's make him the dude again. Here come the Umiads. Okay. Let's go fight him. They're taking a penalty right now, so I'd like to get them while they're low on uh, organization and stuff. Yes, I'm gonna get the Umiads. Die, the Umiads! Fuck you! Yes! And I caught a dude. Get back down to Septa. I don't actually want to fight these guys, so if I'm going to avoid running into them, I will. Don't go there, dude. My wife's covets position. She's terrible. So no. We're doing good. We might even be able to get another tribal army. Awesome. Wipe these guys out. Comes another Umayyad army, but he seems to be going the other way. That's fine. What are you doing? <laughs> that was stupid. Oh, here it comes, here it comes, here comes the big army. Nice! Where's he going? He's coming here. Why would you do that? You're gonna lose. Praise Allah, piece of shit.
You know what? That's fine. Come across and crush you. Ooh. I'll get to Granada on February 14th. Eh. Let's go back across the water. <laughs> Screw you, Umayyads. Nice. 34%. 13% in favor of the... Yeah, I can't really, I can't really, um... Bank on that. Let's go ahead and... Work. Go here. Stay here. I'm coming back, idiots. I just need to siege this province. Okay, they're going to Tangier. Did it keep that siege prior to this? Okay, can I spend any tech points here? Uh, I don't really have any to lose. Okay, one more. One more place. I like how the AI doesn't really take into account what they should be doing here. Why are you going here? I'd like to destroy that army. Okay. <laughs> I like how the Vikings are showing up like, oh, yep, we're gonna Vike you. How many dudes do you have? No. Only 2,000, so that's his entire army over there. I want to I wanna destroy it so that these other guys win. Whatever. Abdel Rahman, my younger brother, wants to know what it's all about. Why are we here on Earth? Make him a proper body Muslim. Awesome. What's this? Or Umayyads? I think not, sir. It's better to have anybody in charge rather than nobody. Unless they have, like, coward on the flank or something like that. I guess that could be worse. Yes! Woohoo! I think that's right. Abdul Rahman, yep. You will be the cruelest in all the land! Squish! Oh nice, that's a revolt. <laughs> I didn't realize that! Yeah, that's, uh, this... these guys? I don't know. Yeah, the stonk is over here with a vengeance. Oop. So not stand in the stonk, shall we? Upper. Our 
lot and if we can help it. Come across, bro. Is that all you have now? No. I just got quite a few. Alright, that's a hundred percent. Give me your stuff. Woohoo! Alright. So. The domain's too big. We should go on a Hodge to Mecca, but first. First, we want to do this. Um, we've got some prisoners. Ransom you. Ransom you. Ransom you. Ransom you. Ransom you. Ransom you. Ransoming you. Ransom you. Okay, so we have too many thingamajigs. mosque. I can give this mosque to one of my brothers, but then it will cause problems for me. Well, it's my strongest son that will inherit, so you, you're pretty, no, uh, you hate me. You don't hate me, though. Not very much. Okay. Let's give him the mosque. And his opinion is now 22, even though it's not showing up here. Let's give him an honorary title as well. Of my chief architect. So his, his opinion is now 32. This guy's always going to hate me, but he also has my shittiest province, so I don't really care. So now I'm at 7 of 5. Um, so I need another ambition. I'm King Martinia. Why don't I have the option to get my diplomacy higher or something? Is this replaced by this? Business focus. Um, I guess we can stay on that. Let's switch to rulership, though. Yeah, that, that helps out. Because um, I don't care about my city opinion right now. I don't particularly like those. Um. So I have to have the law high centralization, uh, which is unlocked by, or medium centralization, which is unlocked by this. High tribal organization or absolute tribal organization, which I do have. Um, all of these are fine. All these other ones are fine. So, whoosh. My domain stuff has dropped. Well, that's because the other guy had 24 martial. Um, I guess now is as good a time as any with... My, my prestige is high enough that I could actually do a thing. Yeah, still have a truce. Well, I've done what I can to weaken them. We gained another province. Um... Go on a hodge to Mecca. Start my pilgrimage. Get our money from our dudes coming in. Preparing myself for my travel to Mecca, I have understood that there are members of my court that have not yet gone on to a pilgrimage to Mecca. As high chief, it's my duty to be charitable to my people. I'll bring one of them with me. So we take Hatim ibn Hatim on on my hodge. He comes with me. Who is a no good dude, but uh, I don't want to lose with piety. It's just a tiny amount of gold anyway. So, 
people are buying prisoners from me. To the covetous bigot Umar. <laughs> May Allah destroy your house. Yes. <laughs> to the gorging glutton Umar. You child of a mangy dog. I don't think these people like me. Woohoo! Go to Mecca. Yes. That makes sense. All of my counselors like me, right? Of course, Chaplin doesn't. He he doesn't actually need to like me. 